Okay. All right, guys, for Sprig Makes This Retrieve, I want to talk about how much I absolutely love working dogs and working dogs of all breeds, from detection dogs to bite dogs to bird dogs, herding dogs. And in this situation, we get to work with a cow dog. Now, my buddy, as you may have met in the past, good, hold, hold, or seen in the past, I should say, uh, 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 heel, just got a new cattle dog named Rambo. And today we're taking Rambo out and we got the opportunity to go out and work some young steers and it's kind of exciting. He got into some situations that were maybe a little hairy, but at least I thought, cause I'm not used to this, but it was still really, really cool to watch him work and see what a dog bred for that can really do. We're gonna show you what that looks like. Now Rambo is far from perfect and we are far from perfect handlers, or in this case, I should say Peter, but it was very, very cool to watch, being able to see him learn and work and be able to um, show off what he was bred to do. Now this goes hand in hand with a question that we get good a lot. And that is, good boy. A question that we get a lot is, can I have, heel, sit, can I have my whatever breed be a bird dog or do a thing? Sure, maybe, kind of, we could eventually get them there, but this is a, a true ability to see why specific dogs are bred for specific tasks and really how good this cattle dog is at what it was naturally bred to do. Now, it's calving season, so there is a chance that there could be a bonus uh, calf pull at the end of this. Stay tuned. I hope you enjoy this video as much as I enjoyed shooting it and watching that young cattle dog work. Roll the film. All right, folks, so we got some steer. And some pears. What do you all call these, Peter? Corianti, but they're pears, right? All right, Rambo. He is away. Away out means right-ish. Circle Ow. the cows. Get out farther. Get Ow. around those far cows. Way baby out there. Our goal is going to be to be able to bring all of them back in together. Good job, buddy. Bring them this way. Good. And you can see clear out there. He's working back and forth, bringing those four this direction. Sorry, they don't have a better oh. zoom on this, but you can definitely see him right in the center there. He said, I'm going to make a run back this direction, but got handled it again. Get back, move on the back side of those oh. cows. Use the term walk, which means to move up on the cows. Keep pushing them this direction. Walk. It's laying down Away. now, not to overpressure. Ah. Away again. Ah. Trying to get ah. on the outside, but he left one cow in the back. Down. Peter's trying to handle him ah. out to pick up that last cow. Good. Down. There it comes this direction. Away. Down. Good job. And he's brought these guys all the way back into us. Send him back out to pick up that last one. Pick up that last Down. cow. Down. So he brought the last this way, and now we're gonna go chase these guys up this direction. Alright, so we've got a little bit of uh corner action as it will be. Basically what we're gonna be working on here is getting Rambo up to try and work these cows. And these cows are pretty green, so they haven't got to be around the dog. And what we need him to be able to do is be able to handle them and then learn to give to him. So let's watch the man work. Away. Away is to come back this way. Basically a, you're looking at the difference between a counterclockwise and clockwise circling here. Oh, there we go. He tried to hold his own. 
but they definitely pushed him a little bit. Peter's trying to send him back by, which would be to the outside here in this situation. Use the term watcher, which means not 100% sure exactly, but basically to keep an eye on the cow that's coming at him. It's important for these guys to all understand and respect the dog, which can allow the dog to be able to help work them better in the future. Around the side here. Peter's using watcher to move up on her, basically keep an eye on it, and then down again when it feels too much pressure. Basically, the cow gave in, moved away, he wanted to down him so that the cow realizes that if it moves away and respects the dog, the pressure comes off. Push that cow again. Again, the, dog. the cow respected him. So you take the pressure off that cow. Going out. Let's bring these guys back this direction. So the cows moved off to him again. That shows respect of the dog, which is gonna help for better herding and directing them in the future. Get ahead. Let's take off the front here. Down. Good. Good, she moved off. So he again down. Come, 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 down. Bye. Bye again. Sent the circle to the outside. A clockwise circle, down. if you will. Going to end up. Good job. He's getting ahead here again. Say, stay put, cows. Stay put, cows. Watch her. <laughs> it's pretty amazing what a dog can do. Yeah. 35 pound dog that'll move cows. Good. Good job, buddy. Nice job, Rambo. So we are headed out to uh, pull a cat. We're moving this cow up to the barn so we can help pull this calf. Grabbing the gate. Keep going just this way a little bit. Yep, I got you. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Nope. Don't got it. So we're gonna bring her up this chute. I'm gonna try and stay out of the way so it don't cause problems. Get her up here in the squeeze and then we'll be able to pull the calf.
like I need to be on the on the business side. Hello, baby. All right, guys, so this is about to happen. We're about to pull this calf, and by we, I mean Peter. So, yeah, hold those. feeling the whole wide world is that little dude going look man thanks for helping me Yeah. birthday little lady that we should say <laughs> and there you guys have it this is the miracle of life we've got dr. Peter you say something Peter this never gets old I do this every day man I love I hope you enjoyed getting to watch a working dog from a different discipline as much as I enjoyed filming it 
we are really looking forward to the opportunity to be able to go down again and see Rambo's progress and Peter's progress for that matter as he gets better and they get better working as a team. I do wanna say, if you guys enjoyed this, definitely throw it in the comments below and we'll see if we can make more content for you just like this. Also, happy birthday to that little calf. Never been involved in a calf pulling before and that was really freaking cool. Thumbs up for the happy newborn calf. We appreciate all of y'all that subscribe. Guys, I'm the guy with the pink gun and we will catch you next time.